When you started with the Rangers in 1979, you were just 27. Do your relationships with players and coaches evolve as you get older, or have they stayed the same? Well, it's really very different. Uh, it's a totally different dynamic. When I started, uh, there wasn't talk radio. Uh, there obviously weren't websites that were looking to find things that are negative about players or that are controversial about players. It was a whole different atmosphere. There weren't that many people who were traveling with the team and covering the team on a regular basis. And uh, part of it also was I was about the same age as most of the players. But you really saw the players as your friends. It's probably much more similar to the way it is in minor league baseball right now, where the announcer and the players might hang out together. That, that doesn't happen too much in the major leagues now. You know, the players are in a, in a different they're in a different class, and they see the press in not necessarily an adversarial light, but not the same way they used to, where it was we're all part of the same team, you know, and we all go hang out together after the games and and be pals. 